Hello everyone, Professor Prophet coming to you from Crabs University with session 17 of our $10,000 challenge where we try to win $10,000 in one month or 31 sessions. We'll be starting off with our usual $1,500 bankroll here, 1,000 in the blacks, 400 in the greens, and 100 in the $5 redbirds. For our first 16 sessions, we've won $5,985, so we're ahead of pace. We'll be looking to win another $400 today. And we'll start that off by placing uh, two units on each one of the numbers, or 320 across. And we will move all these chips down to the bottom of our receiving station as our dice land up there near the numbers, and this will give them room to uh, work and roll around without hitting any of the chips. So we're going to turn the button on, the puck on. Um, everything will be working. We're using the 3, 2, 4, 5 set, the all 7 set. So we're at maximum exposure at 320 across. And one thing we don't want to throw on the come out roll here is uh, a 7. So here's, here's hoping we don't do that. So 6, 2 on the come out roll, that's the easy 8. So that's a uh, score hit. We like that. That'll pay $70, so we'll do the 75 for 5 exchange. Rack those up. Move the puck over to the 8 to signify that's the number. And we'll also pick up our two outside numbers on score hits. 4 and the 10 in this instance. And get the dice set. Walk back to our dice throwing station. See if we can hit another number here. All right, nice throw. Stay together, stay near the wall. And that's center field nine, so that's another score hit for us. And another $70 payout, so we'll do the 75 for five again. Put that in the casino coffers. And then we're gonna pick up the two outside numbers, the five and the nine, get those out of the uh, out of the casino exposure. And that leaves the six and the eight. And we'll try to complete this level by hitting one of those two numbers. Throwing from stick right one is the left hander here today. And there's the six two easy eight. So that's another score hit. And that'll be another $70 winner. And that will also complete this particular level. And if you can complete levels, that's when you start winning some serious money. So turn the button off. And since we've completed the level, we're going to reduce our bets from two units down to one unit. So that'll be 160 across, or 25 on the 4, 5, 9, and 10, and then 30 on both the 6 and the 8. This is the come out roll, and uh, once again, we will have our place bets working. So we'll walk back here with our 3, 2, 4, 5 set. See if we can get a score hit here. Okay, nice throw. 5, uh, five 3, right near the wall. Stay together. We like all of that. And the score hit. So that's a $35 winner. Eight's going to be our number, so we'll move the puck to the number eight. And it's rinse and repeat. Yep, forgot to take down those two outside numbers, so let's do that now. Get those uh, in our rack. And I'm glad we did. It saved us $50. So 5-2, and we are all through with this round. So we'll pick that money up. And again, the uh, pass line, don't pass, cancel each other out. So we don't have to worry about that. The only time you really have to worry about that is on the come out roll. If you throw a 12, you will lose your don't pass. You lose your pass line bet, but your don't pass is a push, so you lose $25. So we'll do 320 across once again. Bring everything down out of the way. 
and turn the puck on so everything is working. See if we can get a score hit here. Nicer away. And looks like a little more AC Ducey. So horn number. And as you know, on horn numbers we uh, take down the two outside numbers. And we're showing you there the pass line don't pass, they just cancel each other out, so no harm done there. So $100 in our uh, rack out of harm's way, so it's 220 inside now. That means just the 5, 6, 8, and 9 will be score hits. And a little too much mustard on that one is one of the dice flew off the table, the receiving station. So let's try that again and uh, try to ease up on, that, on the force that we throw the dice with this time. And when we're throwing dice, what we're looking for is a nice soft landing. Just kiss the wall and then die together near the wall and, and not much separation. That wasn't a great throw, but it was a good enough throw. That's acceptable. And we will take that. 5-1, easy 6. So that's a $70 winner. We do like that. So we'll do the 75 for 5 exchange. Move the puck to the 6. Take down the two outside numbers, in this case the 5 and the 9, and try it again. Alright, got aces in both places on that one, nice throw though. Stayed near the wall and stayed together. Get our die set, walk back to our throwing station. Again, we're throwing left-handed from stick right one, three-finger grip, slight pendulum swing as we throw, and we toss a hard eight, which is a score hit. And it's a $70 payout, 75 for five, and that'll complete that level, and that's what we look for. So we will reduce down to one unit. So 160 across, maximum exposure. So this is the one time more than more than most that you don't want to throw big red. Okay, AC Ducey once again. It's a pretty hard throw there, a little harder than we like to see. Horn number, so you know what that means. The two outside numbers go in the rack. And of course, the pass line don't pass, cancel each other out, so we'll just leave those alone. All right, that's a nice throw. That was a nice throw, but aces in both places, so good for the poker room, not good for the dice table. So horn, horn number, so the five and the nine go in the rack. So down to the six and the eight, let's see what we can do here. Dice in hand, nice easy toss. And six and one. And that means we are all done. So turn the button off. Chips go to the casino. Don't like that. And of course, uh, pass line, don't pass, cancel each other out. And so let's kind of see where we are here. We're looking for $400 profit. Looks like we got a thousand in the black. And there's another 
or 500 in green, so that's our buy-in there. So that tells me we're going to be a little short here. There's another 125. And Yeah, so about two, a little over $200 in profit so far. So it means we're going to have to continue working to get to our $400 goal. So let's continue. 320 across one more time. Put hats on the six and the eight. Pass line, don't pass. Turn the button on, everything will be working. And the three, two, four, five set once again. In the past, we'd use the six, five, five, four with some uh, success, but lately it seems like the three, two, four, five has worked better for us, so that's what we've been using lately. Okay, it's like 6-2 easy 8. So that's a $70 payout. So we'll rack that. Take down the 4 and the 10. Get those out of harm's way. Let's see if we can hit another one here. Let's see, what was that number? I've forgotten now. Uh, eight or nine. I want to say it was eight. Let's see. Which was it? Eight, I believe. Well, it doesn't really matter that much. We'll go with eight, see what happens. Walk back here and see if we can hit another number. All right, hard six. So we'll take that. $70 hit, so we'll exchange 100 for 30. So that's our second score hit, and the outside numbers. Let's see, three, two, four, five, get that set. Throws away, and there's five three easy eight. So that's another score hit for us. Winner eight, and we'll do the 100 for 30 once again. That's our third hit. So we're going to go ahead and pick the uh, chips up and do another count. See where we are. I think we were at 215, if I remember right, before, and we've had, I think, three hits, so that should be another two over $200, so we should be there. So that's $1,200 in the black. And there's another 300 in green, so there's our buy-in right there, $1,500 buy-in. So we'll stack that up and move it over here. And the rest of this is profit, so we're looking for 400. So there's 350, and I think we're there. Like 425. Three. There's 425. Got to leave a tip though. So let's give a $20 tip, and that'll leave us with a $405 profit. Count this out and be sure that's correct. Here 
that's 12, 13, 14, 15, so that's the buy-in. 1, 2, 3, 400, and 5. So, session 17, another profitable in force, $405 profit. And that brings our total for the uh, challenge to $6,390 in 17 sessions. And we have to get to 10,000 in 31 or one month to complete this particular challenge. We hope you enjoyed it, uh, what you saw today, and you'll hit that thumbs up button and consider subscribing to the channel. If you're hitting that casino this week, we wish you nothing but the best, and may all your roles be winners. This is Professor Profit coming to you from Craps University. Talk to you again soon. Bye-bye.